What's up everybody? Once again, my name is Matt and welcome back to Let's Play Super Smash Bros. for the Nintendo Wii U. In the last episode, we completed up Solo Classic Mode, playing as Wario. And in this episode, well, we're gonna try out my man, DK Donkey Kong. We got a custom one, and of course, we gotta use the pink DK skin, cause that is the manliest of all DKs, but let's crank this thing up to 8.0. And, uh, this might be the one, guys. I have a strange feeling about it, although I've said that about, like, everyone else we've played as, so, yeah, you all know how that went, but let's just kick things off. A nice group of four should be nice, although I don't really like the duck hunt stage, but you know what? I think DK might actually do pretty well on it because he does pretty good on a flat stages. Plus, I've also played as DK before. Like, this is actually one character that I have used in other Smash games. Plus, yeah, he still has the ground pound move, man. Like, this is the best move to use against, like, groups of CPUs. Cause just, like, look at this, dude. They will, they will just constantly, like, run directly into that and just get destroyed by me. Um, and I'm probably just gonna, like, spam that a ton. Uh, you know, if we ever get to, uh, fighting me team. Cause I know that'll kill them, like, Instantly, so it'll be perfect, man. But yeah, we'll just uh, we'll just play around with this a little bit, you know, have a little fun with these guys, rack up the percentages, and then we'll knock them out with like other moves. And holy crap, that spike ball, man, destroyed them, demolished. Lucario, I'm not really sure you're making the best use of that star there, but you know what? I'm pretty happy about that. Oh wow, it actually wore off like right as I was about to move and holy crap get destroyed Jigglypuff get out of here all right Lucario just you and me man oh my god <laughs> that was like how do you even predict that like oh my gosh that was like the greatest thing I have ever done in Smash Bros holy crap oh man I'm feeling it this is gonna be the one man as Shulk would say I'm really really feeling it Alright, so let's do this. Ooh, it's a team battle. Um, alright, I'll bring Mario and... Oh, never mind, that's it. We only get one team member. Thought we actually got a second one, but... Ah, whatever. Three teams. I'm sure we'll be able to manage this easy peasy. Although, this is kind of a smaller stage, but you know what? That actually might work to our advantage, considering my ground pound does, like, half of the stage for crying out loud. Just look at this thing, man telling you best move in the entire game right here oh man yeah I don't even want to do anything else besides this because I know eventually if I just keep doing that I'll just win by default like there's nothing these CPUs could even do to me especially since I have like Mario on my team to back me up should actually something bad uh, happen <laughs> it's my favorite move dude it's so much fun all right people are just dying left and right Pikachu well, he's out of here. I actually wanted to take him out next because I kind of thought he was being a problem. Holy crap, goodbye, Sheik. And there we go. We did it. Oh, man. These matches are just going by super quickly. Although, DK, he's my man. Like, he is a power house. So, maybe I should have expected this. All right, round three. Let's do it. Got to take on a whole group of enemies. Man, I really hope we can keep this momentum up because whenever I'm usually having like a really good recording session like this, I usually get like more into the game and as a result the video is just a lot better. Plus, we're going to Windy Hill Zone, man. It's the Sonic Lost World stage. I actually don't own Sonic Lost World, nor I've actually played it. Um, I hear it's decent as a Sonic game, at least it's better than like Sonic Boom is, but we're not going to talk about that. That is neither here nor there. The music here is actually pretty good, though. Although, Sonic games normally do have, like, pretty good music throughout. So, I guess that's really nothing new. Especially to people who have actually, like, played the game before. And Rosalina, alright, you need to calm down with that gun, girl. You are just, like, shooting people left and right. It's not cool, girl. Not cool at all. And, alright, cool. We're back on stage. I thought for a second there... We might have been in some trouble. Let's just ground pound some more because why the heck not? Not like anything bad could happen to us while we're ground pounding anyways. It's like the safest move in the game. Well, thanks Bowser. Thanks for that. You know what? Actually, we should probably take care of Bowser because out of everyone here, him, DDD, 
are probably the scariest. Like, I know Rosalina is really good, but I'm not really too scared of a CPU Rosalina. Ah, oh, dang, I really... Well, I got Duck Hunt Dog at least with that, so that's something, I guess. I kind of wanted to get Bowser, though. Dang it, dude. Curse you and your, like, super armor and your shields and all that jazz. Can you just, like, die for me? All right, well, Rosalina's gone. And, ah, oh, dang it, I really thought my punch was close enough to actually hit him. Dang it. All right, you know what? New goal, kill Bowser with the punch, man. I really just want to do that. Actually, you know what? Screw it. We'll just take Rosalina now. Never mind. That is fine with me. Holy crap, is this a... That's Mother Brain. Huh. All right, so that's what she does. I actually did not know what she did. Well, Bowser, uh, pretty sure you're going to die. Yep. Peace out, my friend. Thank goodness, Blue Shell, the true king of the Mushroom Kingdom, has prevailed. Ooh, and a shield reflector tie. Pretty sure that actually goes to DK as well. All right, so let's see. Um, Yeah, let's just go down here, take on Diddy Kong and Shulk. Why the heck not? Oh, wait, never mind. Two intruders just coming out of nowhere, taking us on. Although I kind of wanted that, uh, that wrench, but Giant Robin and Giant Olimar, holy crap. And we're also going to get a dump ton of trophies if we actually defeat these guys, so let's do it, man. Although I'm not really too afraid of, like, giant versions of either of these characters because, well, Olimar, honestly, I really don't think Olimar is that good. I mean, Robin, Robin seems alright, actually. I might be kind of worried about Robin, but, uh, I'm going to try and face out between them and maybe just get like Olimar trapped in the middle of us that way he takes most of the damage and I can just like not do anything at all you know I mean I know that's kind of like a really cheap strategy but it works pretty dang well in classic mode so I don't really feel bad about doing that at all get out of here Robin oh my gosh did he just uh I'm pretty sure Robin just like dodge rolled into the blast zone of the stage and completely killed himself good job smart guy well just gave him some bunny ears kind of would actually want to use those myself um oh man and he's got a bomb too all right you know what we're gonna risk it all just go for it and we got it. We're the best. There we go. King of the jungle, baby. That's what I'm talking about. You can take your bomb and suck it, Olimar. There we go. All right. Oh, man. I love DK, dude. He's freaking amazing. Get out of here. That's what you get for intruding on my other match that I originally had planned to go for. All right, let's do this. Ooh, we're going to Congo Jungle 64, dude. It's my own stage. Oh, that's it. You guys are screwed. You do not even stand a chance. You cannot beat me on my own turf. Although I should probably, probably stop being a little cocky now because I might end up getting a little too far ahead of myself. But, oh, man, this... So far, this has been, like, my favorite classic mode run, just because there have been a lot of really hype moments. So, hopefully, we can keep that up, because that would be amazing. Oh, crap. All right, be a little bit careful here. Let's not take too much damage. I mean, we're actually pretty high up there already, so let's try not and get ourselves killed early on. At least, you know, not before, like, someone else dies. Oh, my gosh, the cannon. Wow, we actually hit freaking, uh... Samus on the way up. What are the odds of that? Oh my gosh, we did it again. Holy crap. Now, what are the odds of that happening twice? And all right, I just threw that bomb at myself. That was pretty silly. Get out of here with that uh, Gordo or whatever that stupid thing is called. DDD. No one likes you. Oh my gosh, can I make it back? Please, 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 please. Yes, there we go. I don't know how I grabbed that edge. That was like really janky, but you know what? I am not complaining. I will definitely take that. All right, come on. No. Oh, come on. You guys ate all the food. Rude. Rude, rude, rude. All right, you know what? Give me Mr. Freeze and take that. Dang it. Did not even KO him. I was kind of hoping it would. And he still made it back because Sam has freaking got in my way. You guys, you guys just need to die. Like, can you do that for me real quick? 
There we go. Thank you, Samus. All right, DDD, you want to do the same now? That'd be that'd be great. All right. Thank you so much. Your cooperation is uh, very much so appreciated. But there we go. Round five cleared. Next up, I'm pretty sure it's the fighting me team, right? Like, I'm pretty sure that's always round six. Yes, indeed it is. Fantastic. Let's do this then. I pretty much already know my game plan. That's pretty much just, uh, you know, go to the center of the stage and, uh, spam my down B. Hopefully I can kill off, like, all the me fighters that way, because that would be pretty fantastic, actually. See? Look at that. There, that was only one hit on the ground, and it took out, like, three of them already. Like, come on. DK is too sh- Alright, can you guys let me get back on the stage? That'd be great. Thank you. Much of- <laughs> Look at them all! Oh my gosh, that's so funny. All of them could not make it back on stage. That is hilarious. It was They were all like so close too. They just could not make it. I feel kind of bad, but at the same time, that was really, really funny. Dude, stop it. Let me get back on stage. There we go. Thank you. All right, you know what? You guys can have this shell, and uh, I'm just going to do this. You can jump right into that. Oh, come on, last guy. Just do it. There we go. All right. Easy peasy, like I said, just spam that down B and you are good to go. Oh man. Well, now that that is done, guess what time it is, dude? Oh yeah, it's that time. Master hand and crazy hand. Let's do it. I'm excited. This could be the one. Oh man, all right, I'm just gonna like, I'm gonna calm down and I'm gonna try and focus as like hard as I can to do this and do it right because I really want to beat Master Core and I've been doing so far pretty well with Donkey Kong so I'm gonna keep it up and DK just does so much damage oh crap all right there we go we dodged it and oh we dodged that too nice all right can we actually oh thank goodness we did it zero percent dude holy crap <laughs> yes the zero percent the legend Oh my gosh, how long can we stay like this? Honestly, because I feel like we might actually be able to defeat this guy still at 0%, depending on what he actually does. Oh no, get to the edge of the stage. No, never mind, there goes our 0%. Man, if only I'd gotten to the center of the stage, we would have been freaking fine with that. Oh no, not again, crap, that was like the worst time to get hit. Uh, oh, we actually KO'd him already. Nice. Next phase, only 55%. Not bad. Not bad at all. Beast form, let's do this. I can take you on. No problemo, my man. See, the best part of it, holy crap. Wow, we KO'd him super quickly. But yeah, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, the best part about DK, he deals so much freaking damage. We're already on freaking sword phase. Like, this is ridiculous. And oh, man. He's pulling out the big guns, did not expect him to start out with that, but ah, we took a little bit of damage. Oh my gosh, holy crap, he did not waste any time going for his next attack. Alright, phew, made it back on stage, that's good. Ah, dang it, no, 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 come on, bring it back, DK, bring it back. Yes, there we go, my man. Alright, let's just avoid those real quick, do some more damage, dang it. I can still never get past sword phase without losing a stock. I swear, it's like impossible. All right, crap. Avoid this, please. All right, good. At least we dodged the larger attack. And there it is. Sword phase gone. 51%. That's pretty low. I think we got this in the bag, guys. Like, the shadow phase doesn't really bother me. So this should be really, really easy. All we need to do is defeat this guy. And we're going to Master Core, man. We're doing it. There it is. All right. Here it goes, man. We're going to Master Core. Holy crap. I am excited as heck. Um, You know, I'm going to take this now because I'm not sure if that's still going to be there like when it warps me out. Someone in the comments should let me know about that because if it is, I probably should have saved that for later. But here's the first core. And holy crap. Wow. DK takes it out in one hit. Are you kidding me? That is ridiculous. We're still 0% too, so that's pretty good. Well, I really shouldn't... Oh, actually, that actually worked out for the best, so I'll take that. 16% got knocked, like, right where I wanted to be. Not too shabby. All right, so if the cores are in the same spot, which I think they are, 
Uh, yeah, it definitely seems that way. So, I know where the first three are then, so that's pretty good for us. And there's the second core, only two left. So, uh, now that I sort of, like, know the layout a little bit, um, that actually should give me a, uh, slight advantage. Although, I thought it was actually random every time. Guess it's not, though. Oh, I gotta be careful of those danger zones, man. I cannot land in too many of those. I'm actually getting close to... Oh, man, another one. Just one aerial attack takes those things out. But, yeah, I gotta be a little bit careful because... Once I reach, like, 100, if I touch one of those danger zones, it's all over. And I've only got one stock left, so I really, really need to be careful. No, 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 no! Oh, thank goodness, dude. Oh, that was really, really close. All right, where is this last core? I just want to get to it. Come on, it's got to be around here somewhere. Oh, I hear beating. Oh, wait, there it is! There it is. All right, we got this. We got... Oh, no, no, no! No, no, no! Oh, my gosh, that's a combo. Oh, we did it! We got it! Oh, my gosh, 101%, dude! Holy crap! <laughs> yes! Oh, my gosh. Oh, we still got to fight the core thing, too? Really? That's kind of like an anticlimactic ending, but holy crap, I cannot believe... We just did it! Like, I got in that, like, weird trap thing, but somehow I managed to get out and attack before I actually, like... Hit the danger zone again. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy right now. You guys have no idea. <laughs> yes, dude, we got all that stuff too. Oh my gosh, that is so hype right now. Oh man, 8.0 is done. We destroyed it with DK. Now we gotta go higher though. Like, we gotta go 8.5, then 9.0, but... Woo! I am gonna take that to the bank right now. I am... Pretty happy with how that went. <laughs> and I called it too, man. I called that. At the beginning of the episode, I was like, I'm feeling it. This could be the one. And wouldn't you know it, we actually freaking pulled it off. Uh, I love you, DK, man. I really do. No matter what anyone else says, you will always have a special place in my heart now as the character that I first beat Master Fortress with. Like... Oh, man. I feel like... I feel like now that I have, like, a better understanding, too, of, um, how sort of the custom character system works, I think we might have a higher success rate on, um, you know, higher difficulties and stuff like that. Oh, man. I'm actually excited now to even... I'm just, like, I kind of want to just jump right back into it and do another one. Like, that's sort of, like... How I feel right now. Um, you know, we're just gonna fast forward through the rest too because, yeah, if you get over like 90%, it automatically just fills out the puzzle anyway, so there's no reason to sit through the rest of that, but there we go. <laughs> I love DK's taunts too, they're so funny. Alright, that's a pretty, pretty nice little picture there with uh, Villager and Diddy, DK. All characters I actually like. But. Oh, man, let's just enjoy DK's movie, man. I'm just gonna enjoy that. And there we go. That is going to do it for this episode. If you guys enjoyed, a like rating would be greatly appreciated. If you want to see more, consider subscribing. But once again, guys, my name is Matt. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.